Hello, hello. Yep, completely unheard of. So, hello Mimikyu. And to anyone watching the VOD in the future, I'll probably explain this like four or five times during the stream, but... Uh, today's supposed to be Zero Day, where I play Mega Man Zero, and I was actually looking forward to it, because I actually enjoyed the last one we were playing, you know, the second one. Uh, but... The PS4 updated, and then it bricked. So, I have to figure out how to fix that. Which isn't working. I tried for like 20 minutes. To get it fixed up. Uh, but, you know, the one... Issue is you're supposed to like enter safe mode or whatever in the PS4 stuff. And my PS4 doesn't want to do that. It's possible it's not doing that because of the capture card. I don't know. It's possible it may just be broken. So I'm going to figure that out later and then we'll probably play Zero tomorrow. If I do, you know, figure that out. But that's why we're playing this game because I didn't really want to deal with it and waste like an hour of time getting it all set up. When I could instead just start the stream, do something fun, and we'll worry about that later. So, sorry if you were looking forward to Zero Mimikyu. But it will happen. Like how I can flip and jump the same way, but it looks... I'm animated, guys! This is how you animate with paper! You just flip it, and there you go! Animated! Anyways. Uh, if you forgot... Uh, last time we defeated a giant turtle known as the Earth Velumental or something like that. Very metal. Something like that. Hello, there's a thing here. There he is. I have a thing on that tells me where toads are. Like that I finally got Origami King. Was this so highly requested? Where is the stupid toad? Stop ringing the doorbell. Tell me where he is. Is he, like, around the thing? Do I have to jump? What? Where is he? Oh, it's that's the soul. Hello! I'm the last one! Hope you're not too disappointed. Oh, he's been as last toad rolled up in the hole. There are tons of more of us to find. Aha! Uh -huh. Get out of here, you monster. No! Come back! He's too fast. Too furious. Dang it. I wasn't interested because it looks stupid, and I, I stand by what I said. I wonder if we could use the power of the Earth Villain into that tower somehow. I don't need hints for the main story, Olivia. I need true power. Okay, I think I understand what this one is. Just go over here and go over here. Nope, never mind. Hello, Bit. Hope you're having a good day. I'm about to kill this toad. Can I use confetti to, like, cover it up, maybe? No, that, that doesn't work. Okay. I don't remember what powers I have. I don't think I have any powers, actually. <laughs> yeah, you see this little groundhog guy? That's a toad. And he's jerk. I guess I just have to... Yeah, I guess I just have to move it to one of these where he can't escape. There we go. Oh, that was you? I couldn't... I wouldn't have made it so hard if I had known. Yeah, let me make it up to you. A thousand coins. Alright, I forgive you. Found that in the ground, by the way. Do you think those guys walking around with the metal detectors might be onto something? No. 
Most you'll find are bottle caps. I'm not killing him. He just was folded up. I had to make him into himself again. Sorry, I'm back. But welcome to the Origami King. Hey! Oh, you got something you want to talk about? Ah, oh, yeah, that place. Some kind of weird toad living in there. Science is a whole bunch of weird junk. Good luck getting in and see the guy. Place is blocked by some kind of red streamer thingy. As you can see for yourself. Get out of my house. Alright, let's head to that tower, I guess. Oh, I missed a hole. I don't know how I missed that. There we go. All bottomless holes repaired. I do like the how they kind of address, you know, everything's made of paper, so how do all these things exist? Well, they're just made of more paper. They just have these little weird metal poles in the universe. They're all paper mache. I kind of let that one happen. I'm, I'm, I'm bad. Ow. Line them up. Make them cry. I don't. I don't really. Let's see. Ah, oh, okay, I've got it. I had to remember what button that I had to press, but I got it. Great lineup! That's probably my biggest problem with this game. Is I keep forgetting the thing, so it's like it's not on the game. I just keep forgetting what buttons do what. Let's sit on this bench. Hooray! Alright, let's go. Hey, wait, is that a chest? I already got that, okay. But yeah, I'll have to figure out how to fix the PS4. Okay, there's the thing. That was a bug. Hello, Toad. Hello! I'm saved! Now I'm gonna save you, Mario! Try pressing sometime when you're in Pickle. It'll open a whole new world of info. Seriously, I'm talking controls, settings, basic info. It's all right there for you. Was he... Was he listening to us? Did, did he know I was having controller issues? Not my fault, Goomba! This photo Goomba will leave me alone help! Oh, I have to fight him. What do you got for us, Goomba? Wow, that, that's it? Line them up! Perfect lineup! Attack power up. I should get more damage for perfect lineups. Right? Be like times two. Did it. Well, was, it was it just folded or was it folded in the mind? Okay, bye. I don't, I don't think that toad was there before. There's a toad here. Where is he? Is he over here? No. Where's a toad? Hmm. Maybe it's up there. It's in a rock or something. No? Also, what's with this dramatic music? I'm just enjoying a nice stroll through the fields. And yeah, I feel like something evil's happening. Dang it. Nah? Line them up! Make them cry. Hmm.
Uh... Yeah, that doesn't solve anything, does it? Don't leave those angry enemies for too long. They might attack you with super strong attacks. And are you cheating? Are you saving time and money by pausing the game? N no, I would never do that. Always. Let's see. I'm not good at these puzzles, especially when I only have like a second to think about it. It's stressful, man. Um... I don't know. Let's see. I push that up. That won't do anything. Push it down. You'll just send one at the front. Which might fix it, I guess. I don't know. Have an idea. What is it? What's your idea? Some of these are really tough. I'm like, I don't... I can't think of how to rearrange enemies in such a silly way. I think I have to move it forward and then, like, rotate it. Yeah. Shift it down so that the bottom one's there and then rotate them. Dang it. The other problem is I just don't have enough time. Got it. Okay. No, I'm not. That was all you. Oh, no, they're not dead. Oh, no, they're not dead. Okay, shiny boot time. On these. I forgot that drinking red Goompas gives you wings and health boosts. Zero? Huh? Line them up. Okay, this is the same thing, I think. No damage bonus. I still got punched. Weird that it didn't do any damage, but whatever. Okay, now where... was this toad? I need to draw stuff again. I haven't drawn in... a while. No! Whoops. We're not the right area. I'm sorry, I saw the... Dratini. Or what, is that a Dratini or a... I forget what the second one's called. Hello, coffee. Hope you're having a good day. Welcome to... Upsetty Paper Spaghetti. Dragonair, that's it. Thank you, Mimikyu. Alright, drop down here. Hello, Toad! The real question is, am I the first Toad to pop out of a question block? Pro probably I mean, no? Maybe? That's adorable. If only I could draw cute things. Okay, so we're going up this mountain so we can drag down a tower made of dirt using the power of a dancing turtle. Velumental power! Through the power of folding! Why would I ever skip this?
Well, I find this cute. A giant dancing turtle. Alright! Shake it like a piece out of outdated photographic paper. <laughs> this seems dangerous. It seems way more dangerous than it should be. Hmm. That also didn't take as long as I thought it would. Well, not bad if I say so myself, and I do say so. Open sesame! A red mushroom and a green mushroom? A banana? What do these things have to do with each other? Whoa, look at the size of those mushrooms! And that banana, that could feed an army, or at least one really angry monkey. Wait, there's something off about them, isn't there? They're just drawings, flat as paper. Sorry, I forgot your mouth watering there, Mario. Yikes, that's one of the biggest holes we've seen, isn't it? Looks like you need plenty of confetti to fix it up, I'm afraid. I'll be honest, I didn't even notice it. Ta-da! Hey, look at your brother. Hey, you fixed that huge hole! Oh my gosh, it's my brother's face. He's so stupid. Such a dork. This is why I could tell his drawing right away. It's really well done, though. Must have been the some artist who drew the banana and the mushrooms. The same artist. Wait, that means... Whoever drew this knows my brother. I don't know how, but there's no other explanation. Could have just seen him on the, you know, box cover, but... Yeah, I wonder if these are toads. Oh. I was like, wait, they weren't actually toads? Thanks, Mario. You're some keep me on the second floor if you get hungry. I work at the restaurant there. Okay, bye. Don't tell my boss, but I mostly just stand there all day doing nothing, so attack was pretty exciting. Whew, thanks, Mario. Now get back to selling tasteful souvenirs and tasty items. You're in the market for either of those things. Stop me by any time. It's a really well done banana. It's a shame I have to ruin it by slapping this toad. Yes, you noticed me! Well, wow, it's probably drawing. Now I can see it. I kind of wish I'd been part of it, you know? Let's make you wonder, could a toad have drawn that? And if so, with what? Wait, I think I know this one. I think I know what this is, and I don't like it. Welcome, I lied about the souvenirs for the sake of wordplay, but I do have tasty items. Take a look! You only have mushrooms. Those aren't tasty. I never run out of mushrooms, so come back any time. Does anyone ever run out of mushrooms here? No, you're ripping me! There's gotta be a better way! Alright, fair. That's a, that's a fair way to keep me from progressing. Oof, haven't had that much fun at work in ages. Will you fold me back up for another ride? No. That's work. Oh. How am I supposed to get to work? I'm the chef's top radish cook. What if someone orders a radish? That wouldn't be rad. That'd be radish. There's a toad. Where is the toad? Could it possibly be that one? No, impossible. Whoa! Whoa! The door stuck all of a sudden. What could be making it stick like that? Well, now we'll be sticking around for a while, I guess. Maybe we should try heading to the top of the tower for now. But I... I hate being stuck behind sticks. But I need... I need stuff, and I, I used it all. I, I need confetti. Where do I get confetti? We get to know each other pretty well while we were all rolled up, all rolled up, all rolled up, all rolled up. They don't seem excited about that. Are, are you guys okay? Kind of cozy like that, but now it's awkward to roll ourselves up again on purpose, on purpose, on purpose. But I can't hit any trees. There's no trees. And I can't leave. I guess it's okay that I just stole his coins. Can I hit his face? No. What do I hit?
Oh, I had to just open the thing. That's better. Welcome to the Overlook Tower, Mario. The tower with the gift shop. We're still working on that slogan. And it looks like we got some major cleaning to do as well. Our work is a bad mind you, but every time I see it, I'll think of that monster that attacked us. It was horrible. A thin, rattling body and a huge mouth filled with all manner of fangs. Ugh. Think a monster did this? I don't know my... I didn't know my brother was fan with monsters, because it has to be someone who knows his face. Well, I know you're scared, Mario, but it... But Mario's here now. Mario wouldn't be scared, right? <laughs> that means there's nothing to fear, right, Mario? Yeah! Now I can take the elevator. Hello, my two. Hey, could you humor me just for a second? Ahem. <coughs> One. Now passing the third floor. Cosmetic, handbags, men's slacks, oranges, perfume, and camping gear. Along with a lot of trees that Brilly needs. Hello, Skiff. Hope you're having a good day. Those are fancy looking horses. Next stop, the fourth floor. Bicycles, mattresses, formerware, blenders, and comic books. How'd I do? I've always wanted to be an, I'd always wanted to be an elevator operator in one of those fancy department stores. Actually, not too clear about what a fancy department store is, but it sounds fun, right? M mind if I do the same thing in reverse on the way down? Oh, oh that, that. Hmm. Well, that was pretty close. What are these sticks making us stuck? They're positively ruined my department store fantasy. Unless... Dearest elevator passengers, there will be a slight delay while my friend Mario takes care of the emergency. Psst, do something. Don't just stand there and look stupid. I did it. When in doubt, pull the hammer out. Oh no! Going down. Now, I'm okay. Ow. First floor, absolutely flattened princess, crushed dreams, broken glass, and athletic wear. Oh man. You'll make good confetti. For my bag, that's a lot of guys. I don't like it. Um. I don't know, puzzles are hard! I just need to think... Uh, in a stupid way. And I guess I just move... That one over, move them down, move that one over? Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Line up. Attack power up. There we go. I did think it was suspect that they would let me climb a tower through an elevator. Like, what RPG does that? The elevator always breaks. There we go. We did it. Eddie. I'd say the elevator's broken. Maybe try the stairs. Yeah, even if the elevator was just fixed, like, last chapter, it'll somehow break. Or conveniently be broken by the time you get there. Oh sweet, the stairs are fixed. Now I can get to my job, where I endlessly cut radishes. Yay. 
Goku first. I want a radish. There's a toad here. Don't ask how I know. Interesting. Hey, look, a question block. Oh no, not these stairs too. I can't imagine you have that much confetti right now. Think we can even find enough confetti here to fix them? Yeah, yeah, I couldn't help ever hearing and I might be able to help. Uh, something real bad's going on at my restaurant right now. I don't want to say it out loud. I'm the head chef, but I really can't show my face till it's cleared out. Could you help me, uh, take care of the problem and keep it on the down low and I'll make it up to you. Okay. What about this box, though? Oh, there's a hidden box. Oh, I've hit all question blocks. What about that one? I didn't hit that one. Oof. Is that supposed to be me? What was the artist thinking? I'm a blue toad, not a red toad. And also, my face isn't that lumpy. Sorry, I shouldn't be complaining to you. At least of all, after you just rescued me. Yeah, let me make it up to you. Do I really look like that? I want another portrait. Maybe they ran out of blue. They did use blue to stab my elevator. Ominous. Are they allowed to have wine in the Nintendo game? Oh. You're gonna come back and pay for that later, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Ta-da, it's a toad. Thanks for that, Mario. Just a tip, I wouldn't order anything from the kitchen after the state of the folded soldiers left it in. Well, I kind of expected him to be like, Who ate my food? Hmm. Is that just for a coin? Weird. Where is this toad? Wait, is it this? No, it doesn't look like it. There has to be a reason to go up there. Video games don't make random pathways. Those don't exist, Reborn. Also, hello. It doesn't count as tiny if you just throw away everything in one drawer. Ouch. Talking directly to me. Oh, thank you for that. And fun fact, I weigh as much as a single carrot. Oh, this carrot looks pretty stacked. And also broken, but mostly stacked. One of those folded things threw me behind behind its back, off the wall, off the ceiling, then right into that thing. It was actually an amazing shot. But I'm still annoyed. That was horrible. I was beginning to compost. Did I know there was going to be an oxen free too? No. Why is there going to be an oxen free too? Didn't it end with the endless loop? Why am I pressing? Like one of those shows about bad restaurants. Let's open everything and investigate more. Why did I need to... I didn't need that game. Phew, thought for sure I was going to be someone's breakfast. Alright, if it's different characters, that's fair. Keep the kitchen clean. Wash your hands. Seriously, wash your hands. Oh no! Goomproaches! Ow! Eh. I'm back here.
Okay, got that one. Don't let anyone know that there are mushrooms in the kitchen. Can I turn on the heat or something? No. Oh, I had to step on it. Okay, that's fair. But where's the last one? I don't have a roach in my heart. Gotta get all those things, Mario. How bad looks have them crawling around the kitchen? Pretty bad? I don't know. I don't have heart roaches. Reborn. Please don't insinuate that I am bugged in any way. Although I am. I'm still quite upset. Dang it. Did, did they leave or? Yes, okay, they did leave. And that's why there was a pathway up here. See? This road went somewhere. I, I guess. Did I get it? This? No? The music stopped, so I assume that means there's still more in here somewhere. Oh, it's right there. I'm as blind as three bats. This place is slightly messier than usual. Okay, we got all the roaches. That'll teach that chef for cooking with Goombas. Uh, I don't hear the pitter patter of little pests anymore. You did it. Here, I hope you enjoy this friendly chopped confetti. Bon appetit. Hooray! It was about as much as I would get from a tree. Go, confetti, go! It's still not enough. Oh, it was enough. Never mind. Bottomless holes repaired. Which means we're not going to be doing this again. Hopefully. The hammer isn't working. Why not? What am I supposed to do then? Use the door? Like a commoner? I'm a plumber. I don't use doors. I use pipes. Anyways, push the door. Locked out. Looks like it doesn't- looks like pushing won't work. But how can we get to the top if we can't get in there? Hmm... Rockets? Okay... Hmm... Okay, that didn't work. I don't think colored pencils are really rockets. They just keep coming. We gotta get out of here. Huh? Something on my face? 
Oof. Well. We fixed that. Hello. There's no toads here? Weird. What does this button do? Come on! Why is it so slow? Ah, uh, it's slow for dramatic timing. Good thing this game is made for babies. Oh boy, coins! And every baby loves circles. Uh, you are right. I never used... Oh, it broke the thing. I never used colored pencils as rockets because I threw one once and got in trouble. I'm not hurt, so I don't need that. Oh man, I thought for sure they'd throw me out with all the other broken pencil bits. Thank you. Top level of the tower, but I swear those colored pencil things keep flying down from above. I'm not throwing the colored pencils, though. You gotta believe me. It's not me, it's Mimic you. It's not an excuse, it's the truth. There's the end of the streamer. That's my brother's face right in the middle. He really is making sure everyone knows it was him. Should we try to detach it somehow? Ooh, maybe you jumped onto it from below? Nice view, but should we do something about the streamer first? No, I want to look at the thing. So demanding. Hmm, is that the most powerful jump you can do? Didn't you get, like, level 3 shoes? Oh no! Oof. No, you can't end my life as a streamer. Just for throwing a colored pencil. I was just trying to make a mark on history. I was trying to draw a rocket. I'm innocent, I tell you. Innocent. Yikes, I was way too close. I think those sticks would stick to their own business. Aw oh, man, you were almost out of the picture for good. I don't know what what's a colorful way to talk. Oh no! It's a box. Ah, hang on. Missile Maestro colored pencils. Hang on, Penny wants out. They're not. My impressions are really bad. I can't do any high-pitched voices. That makes my throat explode. So I can't do feminine voices. Much to my shame. I'm sick and tired of Philistines like you erasing all of my- or Philistines. I, I love that song. I don't know why I don't know how to pronounce that. Like you erasing all of my hard work, man. You probably haven't heard of me, right? Figures. When was the last time you even went to the gallery? <laughs> Don't answer. I'm gonna give you a lesson for free. My name's Jean Pierre, Collard Pencils the Twelfth. I represent the Legion of Stationery. I'll have you know. He's French? Uh. What's a French accent? Oh no. The Legion of Stationary. 
their rules are as paper thin as their commitments. But they're very colorful. Anyway, I'm guarding this streamer and I'll scribble on your flat face if that's what it takes to stop you. Legion of Stationery, Jean... P P that's way too long to remember. I'm just gonna call you colored pencils, okay? I just want my brother sent you to try and stop us, okay? Alright. Well, colored pencils, you talk tough and you draw really well. But have you even heard of Mario? Yeah, that's what I thought. Mario's tough and he's got a mustache and he's gonna mess you up. Right, Mario? Why does everyone always go on about Mario's mustache? I mean, it's a good mustache, but... There's more to his character. <laughs> Feast your eyes upon my art skill. Or arsenal. Twelve colored pencils ready to make your paper bodies my canvas. Colored pencils? Really? <laughs> Thank you, Toads. This is- this is the one boss I knew of that I was like, that's stupid. Why are colored pencils a boss? Use the arrows! Pew 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 pew! What the- Oh! This is tedious. Locked on targets! Hmm, must- that magic circle doesn't look like it has any power. Is it on break? What's... Wait, what's that? That's the first time we've seen a panel like that. Looks like a switch. Maybe it activates something. Like, I don't know. The magic circle. Nah, that's stupid. There we go. That should work, right? Avoid the targeted panel. Sneak behind the case and whack it in the lid with your hammer. Oh. Well, I didn't do that part. They all miss. No, my missiles are flawless. It's the target that's all wrong. Ah, spoken like a true artist. Now it's my turn. 100 or 1,000 fold arms. Yep. Oh no! Aha, uh -huh, I don't do collaborations, so hands off. Okay, so I had to hit it first, I guess. Watch as I unleash my full artistic vision. Let's see if you handle the rest of my missiles all at once. really do a lot of damage. Reload complete, and I have plenty more where those came from. Alright. Now that I know how this fight works... Oh wait, I think I missed something. Yep, I missed something. <laughs> it's a hit. I knew it would be. Careful, Mario. It looks like those misses are waiting for the targeted panels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I already know. Well. Those count as spikes? But why? Huh. Alright, we'll do this for real this time. Hopefully. I don't think we have any pencil sharpeners, though. Um... Nope, that's not gonna work.
Nope. Hmm. Dang it. Well, this isn't gonna go anywhere, but I healed. Oh, I just fell right off. Okay. Hope that didn't take a point off my iron boots. Am I going to be afraid of pencils after this? Feels like it. I don't think I am. Nope, I got nothing. Wait. There, that that should do it. Whew, I did it. Also, hello gun. Hope you're having a good day. I finally got a hit off. No, no, my lid is closed! I can't stop my missiles! Wow 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 wow. This is exploding its mouth. Awesome. Mouth? I guess this chatterbox mouth is a weak spot. Heh. Use the arrows. Okay, so we need this here, and then that there. Yes, it is the case, apparently. And now... Ha! Nice try! Ow. Did you enjoy my biting critique? Was I supposed to... What was I supposed to do there? Hmm. Alright, so now I have to go... Somewhere. Yeah, that doesn't really do anything, does it? I guess that's fine, I don't know. Oh, I got an extra move. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, 
Okay. Ah, nice try. Alright, so that didn't work. Because I have to use the thousand hands from behind? Alright, here we go then. That's not a good one to do, is it? If nothing else, I can just keep doing that. Oh, these are already active. Neat. So I guess Thousand Hands does the exact same thing, huh? Everyone's a critic, I won't let my work be disrespected like this. Time to roll out my masterpiece. Behold my rainbow roll! Oh no. What does that do? All you're doing is spinning... ...colored pencils around. What does that do for you? Yeah, it just made me close the lid again. Dude, this looks like a big, big trouble. We have to stop it. Is there some way to arm ourselves so we can handle this attack? Yes. I guess now is when I was supposed to use it. Can't close my lid in the middle of a rainbow roll! Oh. Okay. Attack it from behind! Don't attack it from behind! Attack it from the front! Don't attack it from the front! I'm being taken for a rainbow roll right now. Yeah, yeah.
I'm not about to die. I'm fine. Oh, wait, whoops. See? Totally fine. Magic circle on! And now I stab you! This is what good guys do! No, you made me waste my precious missiles. Do you have any idea how expensive good art supplies are? And right now my accent is gone. And now at least I don't need any missiles to do this. That's a worst case scenario right there. Let's see... Yeah, doesn't Dracula drain the collar from his uh, enemies? That's what we did. Kaboom. We did it. Oh, he evaporated. I was expecting like a... Quip. Okay, there we go. No! No way! Defeated by a no-name, no-talent piece of disgusting pulp culture! <laughs> you were better when you were a side-scroller, man. Ugh. Oh, hey! Convenient! A new magic circle appeared. It's almost like it came from that colored pencil thing you defeated. Maybe it's really important. No, it couldn't be. Don't really think that's how streamers work, but, you know, whatever. I guess unrolling it would have been too much of a chore. Confetti! Congratulations! Red streamer cleared! Oh no, now they're gonna kill the blue one. Hmm? Max confetti increase? That's not a reward! That was amazing, and we both did something! Eh. Like I said before, we do make a pretty good team. Looks like you're back and hold more confetti now. Congratulations! Confetti-lations. Alright, that was really exciting, but we got a lot more streamers to unravel. Like that nerd reborn or something. Which color streamer are we going to head towards next? Oh yeah, the blue streamer on the Red Mountain. That's as good a place as any. Maybe even better, because it looks pretty... So pretty from here. Can I look at these now? Ten coins! Ugh. Hmm. That, that, that's it? That, that's all it does? Okay. What about this one? I've been on the wrong end for way too long. Move over, it's my turn for review. Oh, I don't get to... Okay. I'm leaving. All those drawings by that colored pencil guy are gone. Maybe they disappeared when we beat him. Oh, he was a bad guy, but his art was pretty good. Whoa, that's a real doozy to think about. It's almost like artists can be really bad people. Here's where I normally see one of the Overlook Tower Observation Deck. Enjoy the view. Guess I can still say it and you can still enjoy it, but I'm not gonna like it. 
Okay. Hello, doof. Hope you're having a good day. Okay. Oh, you have to push from there to open it. Yeah. Don't want people falling off. I know that they won't ever turn to Toads, Mario, but can we let... Can we let them hope and dream? What? Hello, Harmony. Hope you're having a good day. Welcome to Shrim. Hope you had a good sleep, doof. And we did it! Do-da-dee-da! The Sensor Lab on Picnic Road is now open. So yeah, that was where I was gonna go, so... 2 a.m. Ugh, time zones. It's only 4 p.m. here. But meh. Hope you enjoy your ramen. Was doing okay until the PS4 updated and destroyed itself, so I had to fix that later. Have to find a USB to deal with it. Because we were supposed to be playing Mega Man Zero today, but. Sensor Lab! I didn't feel like dealing with the PS4 right now, so. Mario, I should have known. Thank you. That was it. Sensor Lab, Picnic Road Headquarters. Where does this go? Hope it doesn't yell at me for using this guy's pipe without his permission. Oh, we're back in Toad Town. Why? Yeah, why would El Pizzo do anything evil? Yeah, let's see if there's any new tools here. Oh wait, this is the battle lab. Hey, welcome back, Mario. I've been waiting to show you something new. Timer extender. Okay. Called the timer extender. Have you- Are you tired of the old battle timer hitting zero before you finish hitting your enemies? Well, this doodad will automatically pull some of your coins and bump that timer back up once per turn. He has a bankruptcy blocker function that lets you set up a cap on the amount of coins it pulls. Set up the opening by- on the menu with B and turning it on with B. No thanks necessary, Mario. I'm just happy to be helping a real hero. Yeah, we've been streaming for an hour already. I don't know what would be suspicious about that, other than the time stream potentially being messed with and slowly ruining your sense of how time progresses. What are the chances of that? Wait for a new shipment of accessories to arrive. Come back in a bit, okay? Okay. AKA, get out of my shop. I don't have anything. Rude. I know I'm putting words in Toad's mouth, but rude. Alright, anything in the weapon shop? No. Absolutely nothing of value here. 
All right, what's in the sensor shop? I sense that plot progression will happen here. Scientist Toad? Sensational! You found me, Mario! This is a perfect... This is perfect! I finally found a suitable tester! See, I'm the head researcher here at the sensor lab. We develop technology capable of detecting all kinds of things that are otherwise difficult to see, like the truth and reality. Sensor tech is changing the world! We're breaking conventions and shifting all manner of paradigms or whatever. Because you've shown an aptitude for toad detection, I shall let you test our new creation, the Toad Radar. With this little beauty, you can suss out hidden toads. That definitely was not in Japanese. Without suffering even a single crease in your brow. Up down that pipe, I'll give you a quick primer on how to work the toad radar. Okay. Would you like to test the toad radar? I told you to do it, but, you know, you don't have to. Testing, one, two, one, two. Can you hear me, Mario? Let me walk you through a quick test of the toad radar. Can you feel the device in your head? Spinning around, round and round, and ruining your hat? As you may have guessed, that's the toad radar. This will scan the area and react to any hidden toes that may be, you know, around. The closer you are to a potential toad, the stronger the toad radar will react. When you think you found one, try whacking nearby objects with your hammer to unfold the toad. Activation level. The advanced level of detection uses a massive amount of power, so the battery will drain quite fast. No power, no toad radar. Got it? Keep an eye on your battery. Okay, that's enough explanation. Let's run some actual tests. Hmm. Find the hidden toes before the battery runs out. Why don't I just whack everything, though? I found it. I didn't notice any difference, but okay. You know, like, obviously it's that one, but... I feel like the bell is getting more done than this radar. Oh boy. Amazing, it works! Thanks to you, our test was a total success! Uh, no, I got some notes. Must say, that went exceedingly well! The Toad Radar didn't even explode this time! How lucky! All that remains before certification is a robust field test. Go out to the world, Mario! Use the Toad Radar to rescue some helpless, folded toads! Hooray! When the battery runs out, you can use your preparedly device charger to juice it back up. However, Requires the modest donation. Power isn't cheap, and funding is hard to come by. My work here is incomplete. There are paragraphs that yet unshifted, so back to it. What does this do? For the device being unresponsive, perhaps there's a paper jam on the other end? Huh. A paper jam? That's a different game. Well, I was wrong. This was no plot. There were no plot developments in this building. Well, onward we go. Did it even tell me how to actually turn on the... Oh, it's an item. Interesting. And he's dead. Of course, I've already got most toads here. Not all toads, but most toads. Oh, I'm missing so many things. Look at all these things I have to collect. <laughs> the worst feeling. Alright, if you were a stuck toad in Picnic Road, where would you be? 
other than in Picnic Road. Apparently you would be right here. Popcorn, popcorn, get your fresh popcorn. It's a hundred coins bag. Coming right up. There's a toad in there. There are several toads in there. I did not ask for pop toads. Corn. Can I have my money back? Popped all the corn, pal. Sorry. So I don't get my money back? Very rude. Like, I didn't get any popcorn. <laughs> also, he was popping his own brethren. All sales final, no refunds, even if you don't get what you paid for. Capitalism. Alright, where's this last toad? There has to be, like, one more just... ...sneaking away somewhere. Hello, Blood Silver. Hope you're having a good day. Where is this toad? Maybe he's like behind this shop? No? You just missed our horrifying fight with a bag of or a box of collared pencils. Yeah, if only I had something that would detect toads, but... Dang, I can't think of anything that would do that other than this bell. Which isn't working for some reason. Oh, here's one. Somewhere. Oh, there's a hole. Ah, the sun! The sky! Fresh air! I'm free! 100% Toad's Rescue. Hooray. You are alive. I can confirm. Dead people don't talk on Twitch. So. You're sorry to burst your bubble. There are no zombie streamers. Alright, what about here? We're missing a hole and a toad. Dow! Wait, but I have iron boots. Can I just use those? No? Okay. Uh, line them up. I did it. A <laughs> sea tuber. If I ever get a avatar, it'll be a zombie blob. Sounds good, right? Alright, where would this toad be? Oh, dang it. Wave battle! Huh? What's that? Give that magic circle back! You can't even use it! If they won't give it back, you have to take it back. Take it back! But why? Um... Hang on, let me think.
But how do I take that thing back? Do I jump on him or do I smack him? Hmm. Well, let's see, I have two moves. I'm shamelessly cheating. I mean, I guess I just rotate that one and then rotate the other one? Yeah. Let's do this. There we go. Don't actually know how much damage these guys can take, but... No mercy for thieves! I don't know what I'm doing. That's my trick. Mario's turn! How does this work? Oh, I just have to use it? Okay. Let's go! Earth Velumental. Just she just just completely destroy them. Well, I kinda of expecting her to dance. Oh, okay! <laughs> That was more damage than I could do! Well, they're dead. Beyond death. And look, if they didn't want me to cheat, they wouldn't give me the option to cheat. Alright, alright. It's not my fault the timer stops. It's just my fault I'm taking advantage of that. Because I'm not a fast planner. Now where is this toad? And I've already been back here. Hmm. Pretty sure this staircase wasn't messed up before, but whatever. It's fine. Oh, there's a toad nearby. Where could he be? Another day or two in there and I was gonna bloom. I don't think mushrooms blew in the sun. You guys did it! I'm free! You wanna go to Autumn Mountain now? Hasn't been that long, but I can't wait to operate the tram again. It's tramtastic. That's where we're headed, right, Mario? Because it looks like that's where the blue streamer leads. I got some past your, one past your wings. Let me know one way or the other. You catching this ride? Yeah. Hey, what's the hold up? Everything okay out there? Everything's fine, sir. Just getting these final passengers ready. Off to the Autumn Mountain. Enjoy. Who is it? Who is our new friend? I have no idea who it could possibly be. Possibly a bomb? Wow, this is amazing! We're so up so high, the view is so fast, these mountains are so huge! Are you seeing this, Mario? Mountains here, mountains there, it's mountains all the way up. Why didn't anyone tell me that the world could be so wonderful? It's your first time out of the house or something? Oh, were you asleep? I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to wake you. I'm just very excited. No, I was talking when you were getting on. She does not look good when she's sitting down. My friend Mario and I are on a quest to follow his big blue streamer. What's your story? What brings you aboard the tram today? Me? Well, I'm a bomb. And, uh, that's about all I remember. You know that memory loss thing? What's it called? Ambrosia? Amnesty? What do you think of Thinky Panic? I don't know. Whatever you call it, I've got it big time. So I'm on a solo journey to try and remember, well, anything. My home, my purpose, all that. Hmm, you have amnesia? You don't have any memories? Oh, you poor thing. I have a great idea! You should join us on our quest! We can help you recover your lost memories and make a ton of new ones along the way. 
What do you say, Mario? Wouldn't it be great if this guy joined us? Wow, really? Gee, I couldn't put you two out like that. I mean, it's a kind offer, but, uh, I don't have any special moves. I'd just be in the way. I mean, I could probably be talked into it if you really wanted, but, uh... Okay, never mind. You raised some great points. It's probably better for you to travel alone. Sorry to bother you. Have a good journey. Uh... That, uh... Final offer right there, because, I mean, you got some good points, but, uh... You know, I forgot that you, uh, said no, so... Uh, hey, is that offer still on the table, you know, to join you two? Because, uh, I might be considering it, joining you, that is, on your quest. You, the cool stash and the big M, your name was Mario, right? Sounds familiar, I feel like you're some kind of pro with this adventure stuff. So, uh, can I join you? Join you, that is, please? Just for funsies, say no. Hmm. Also, sorry, no blood silver. I think I did that once, but that was like 20 years ago. Should I say no, Mimikyu? Final offer. I'd feel bad rejecting this little bomb, but... Ah, so I should say yes. Haha. -ha. You fell for my trap. Yes to no. Ah, I see. Right, because I said all that stuff about being in the way. Yeah, I'd just be a burden. I get it. No odd feelings. I'm gonna nap before we get down a mountain. Okay, so listen. Thought about it a bit more, and that floating lady already invited me to join, right? Taking the offer back now would be really mean. And you don't look like a mean guy. So here it is. Cards on the table. I'd love to join you both on your quest. What do you say, Big Gam? Uh, yes or no? I mean, I have the feeling it doesn't matter, much like every single other yes or no thing I've been given in this game, but... What do I say? This guy's the bomb! Well, to be honest, I want to say yes just because I feel really bad. <laughs> I'm a chump. Yeah, sure. Hooray! Oh, check out the top of that mountain. It's bright red. That has to be Autumn Mountain. Well, you're right. That mountain practically screams Autumn. Has to be it. Means we'll be stopping soon. Can't wait to stretch my legs. Assuming I have them somewhere. Must have forgot them somewhere, I guess. Now that we're traveling, buddies, let me introduce myself for real. I'm ba -bomb. Could have a unique name, but that would give this game some credit. I promise not to slow you down, Big M, and you too, ma'am. My name's Olivia. Nice to meet you. You know, these, these guys are all witty with their dialogue and their stupid jokes, but they can't be bothered to give a bomb a no normal name. Like, even if I thought this game was really good, I would still complain about that. Make a stupid bomb pun. Just make, call him Bobombi or something. Or Bobby the Bomb. Bobby the Bobby Bomb. You know, something easy. The leaves are such a bright shade of red, it's so beautiful. Even though this place was supposed to be pink. This is like the perfect place for new memories, right, Bombert? Uh, the name's B Bomb, man. Anyways, we should probably start following that blue streamer. Apparently his name is Bombert. The Autumn Mountain, up in Autumn. Oh, Mario, thanks for the save. Come see me if you want to ride the tram, okay? I apparently am the guy that runs the tram. How did it get up here, then? Get the fish. Nice hat. Phew! Flap! 
Flops are flopping me out. Flop? I mean, huh? It's Mario! Flopper! Thanks a flop! Uh, a lot! I've been stuck in this mountain for days, longing for the open sea. See, I'm actually Sea Captain Toad. See? I'm a Captain Toad! I'll be tending to my shop at the port in Toad Town. Stop by and give me a hoy on your next visit. Oh, a Sea Captain that just jumped off the mountain. I just love the idea of cruising around the open ocean. It sounds elegant. Next time we're passing through Toad Town, we should definitely stop by the port to see his boat and his grave because he just jumped off a mountain. The tram's right there. Why didn't he just take the tram? Ugh. Oh no, is there a toad nearby? I would have never have guessed. Why was that a loading screen? I literally just walked behind this thing. Why was that a loading screen? And there's no toads here? Just money? Okay. That's rich. Hey, this must be the streamer you two were talking about. I apparently remember what streamers look like. Looks like the source to the, is uh, to the left somewhere. I'll see out up ahead and definitely won't blow up. Careful, Bombus. Don't fall. Please don't call me Bombus. My name is Bobomb. <laughs> don't worry, I definitely heard him this time. I'll be sure to get Bobby's name right from now on. Thanks, Olivia. I'm glad someone agrees with me. Sure it's okay to let Bobby wander off on his own like that? Well, apparently his name actually is Bobby. Cool. Even though his name's actually Bomb. Hey, Big M! Check this out! What the? A dead end? How are we supposed to follow this streamer now? Curse you, lousy dead end! These boulders are way too big to jump over, even for a guy like you, Big M. That sounds like a challenge. We can go that way, I guess we can see what's up the mountain. Okay. Let's go, Bobby. But that's not actually his name. That's just Olivia being stupid, but hey, I'll give them I'll give the writers credits for making someone give him a name. Oh, what's this? Another potential traveling buddy? Hey, Pointy, want to make some fun memories with us? Bobby, stop! Be careful, those folded soldiers are dangerous. This little guy, really? I guess the spikes do make him look tough. Alright, I'll steer clear of these foldy guys. Dang it! Mario won't, though. Wait, Bobby's just gonna... Sit there? <laughs> oh, well, hello. Olivia Coffee. Coffee Olivia. My cousin's name is also... Oh, I forgot I could do that. It's also Olivia, so it's extra weird. Let's see. It looks like these are just... Rotate here, yeah. That was an easy one. Yeah, the it's like that's how they got around it, I guess. It's like, oh, they the name actually isn't Bobby, but Olivia is just gonna keep calling him that. Coffee via. Ah, die. Also, what's with this music? It's good, but oh, hey, Koopas. I haven't seen those in a while. Hmm. Um... Also, he's just gonna sit there?
Okay. Like obviously, I have to do this, but then I have to move those two. Oh, yeah, obviously. Duh. I forgot I have to hammer them. Just samurai vibes, sure. I guess it would give me more of that if they were cherry blossoms and not autumn leaves. I did it! Dang it. I hit him with the hammer, though. Oh, so when's Bobby gonna do something? He's just sitting there watching. Hmm, okay. Only one move? I mean, I guess it would just be this, right? It would just be these, but, you know, pink. Right? I did it. Gee, sure would be a, ta a shame if a bunch of turtles got destroyed by a giant turtle. Oh, wait. Where's Bobby? I sense... Cheep Cheeps? Oh no, they're drowning! Or suffocating? What do you call a fish that can't... swim? Hi there, little fishies! These mountain fish spend their whole lives flopping around the surface. How interesting. Uh, I know I lost my memory, but that doesn't sound right. Don't most fish kinda need water? That looks interesting. I'm sorry, fish. I shouldn't have smacked you. Line them up. Um... I guess just that, but I wanted to hit them all with a hammer. Alright, will a hammer kill them in one go? Okay, if did that much, so that means the boots are probably fine. There we go, we did it. We killed a bunch of fish. Making us the heroes, apparently. And now there's a bunch of canned fish? Hmm. Whoa, a boat! All the way up here? Oh, Bobby, you poor thing. May not be too well traveled, but I knew that boats float. 
This thing is just sitting here. It can't be a boat. Amnesia must have sapped your memories and your brain power. How cruel. Hey, you feel like you're being uh, pretty rude here, right here. I know what a boat is, ma'am. There's a boat here, then there's supposed to be a lake. Now, if that's the case, this lake must be... All dried up! Whoa, that's astounding. So this is the lake. Isn't that dangerous? We, we could get soaked. We have to get out of here before we get pulped. This lake looks dry, so we're probably fine. But if there was water, we could ride in this boat. We could do that. We could float right over to that dead end and float... Follow the blue streamer. We have to fill this lake back up? I don't have a clue how to help with this one. Where should we even start? Perhaps with this bottled water? If we fill the lake up one bottle at a time... Came here to see if I can get a job with the river tourist, but I ended up getting canned. Literally. That tour guy must be really love tuna. Even though tuna doesn't exist in this world. I'll be paddling with one oar works up an appetite. It's a monkey. What a funny little guy. Hey, monkey, what are you doing up there? You're definitely not a toad in disguise. Must be shy. This is a lot of canned food. Must be an entire year's worth. The labels say A-N-U-T. What's an anet? Oh, wait, which region are we in? I guess reading it backwards, I guess. It's just tuna. What region do you read the opposite way? Oh, cool! I found a thing! That looks pretty. Look at that! Incredible view, right? Check out that building over there! Getting a total shrine vibes! If I was a big shot water spirit, I'd want to live in a place just like that! I agree, Bobby. It does look like very watery and shrine-like. Hold on, a water shrine? For some kind of water spirit? Could that be the Water Velemental Shrine? Is Velemental a word? Mario, we found it! That has to be a home of the Water... The home of the Water Velumental. Lord of all liquids! You know, Poseidon! So this Water Velumental guy is some kind of water boss, huh? Why don't we ask if we can fill the lake back in? Yep, I mean, that's what the sign says, so... Oh, look! A thing! Look at this magic circle. It's got a real water elemental look to it, don't you think? With a magic circle like this, but we could do something about the dry lake. Let's head to that shrine, Mario. And probably beat him up. Right, so the earth elemental was a turtle. I guess this one's gonna be a dragon? Fallen leaves. So much tall grass, how pretty. Might not be able to see you in there, Bobby. Stay close, don't get lost. Don't conveniently disappear. Aha. Found the toad. Well, how'd you find me? Could you read my thoughts? Are you reading them now? Please don't. Nope, I can just sense when I can't move. I fell down! Finally, rescue! I was so lonely down here on my own. Here, let me thank you with this. Affection! Oh, Max Heart. I've become more powerful. Vellum is a type of paper. Okay. Is this an all-powerful paper? Oh no! I'm sorry. I smashed that poor turtle into oblivion. Got to drop on him. Does that do damage to everyone? Oh, hey, the first mix-up. Line them up. Uh, 
Now Bobby's just actually asleep. I didn't mean to. It was... The game did it. It looks like there's another toad around here, but where? If only I had some item that would allow me to scan for toads. Ugh, oh well. Vellum Elemental? Nah, I don't get it. What kind of paper is it? I found him! Phew! I'd given up hope that I'd ever get out of here. Thanks a ton! You know, I will say that even though I get nothing out of it, really, the puzzle fights aren't too tedious. I'm really bad at them, though. Hmm. Which is why I have to cheat. I'm sorry. Made of animal skin, kind of like leather, but way thinner? Hmm, interesting. I don't know much about how paper's made. I read a manga that was basically all about that, but it was really boring, so I stopped reading it. Let's see... I got nothing. If I had three, I could do that, but that's not going to do anything. Yeah, that one. It's really bad. <laughs> it's just, like, nothing happens. She just keeps trying to make paper. But, like, nothing interesting ever really happens because of it. You know what I mean? Hmm... I guess, yeah, that would work. Before the paper war. I also read the, like, from the comments on it that they have this whole moment where their sibling gets close to them or something and it's like, I'm gonna help you do this stuff so you won't be alone or blah blah blah. And then he just stops being a character. Just doesn't exist anymore. I was like, that's boring. Like maybe I stopped before it got to the really good stuff, but I don't know. Wayside Water of Elemental Shrine. All offerings are appreciated. Damp offerings preferred. Damp. What a tiny house! How cute! Why are there cans here? Made it through the tall grass! You kept brushing against the outside of your pocket. So tickly. It's hard not to laugh. And Bobby has conveniently disappeared. We'll be there before we know it. Just a bit further, right Bobby? Oh no. And he's gone. He uh, probably got excited and ran ahead of us again. Yeah, it's cute he wants to show off how fast his little legs can move, assuming he has them somewhere. There's a toad. There he is. Thank goodness someone finally found me. Now I know how lost keys must feel. I don't think keys get smacked with a hammer. You think this universe had a paper war? I mean, obviously there's Mario and Bowser always fighting each other, but... Is this the first real paper war? I 
maybe not my keys. No, I can't say I've ever hit my keys with a hammer. Water of Elemental Shrine, Chestnut Valley. Okay. It's locked. No. Phew, good thing I wasn't pulled up on the other side of this bridge. If I was stuck in that tall grass, you might never have found me. You need some super sensory powers. Yes, super sensory powers. And definitely not just a bell that jingles. I got the toad tram. Why is the toad tram not in the shape of a mushroom? Easy joke there. Speaking of the shape of a mushroom. Huh. A sensory door? Well, this guy looks like he's got some business happening. Maybe we should... I mean, he looks normal, really, just a little flatter. Yeah, thank you so much, Mario. Thought I'd be jammed in there forever. A paper jam. One of the Sensory Lab's satellite offices located right here in the Autumn Mountain. I felt advanced sensory tech to help adventurers like you. Can't offer you anything myself, but I'm sure the head researcher has something useful. You should pay him a visit. Get at the thing. You know, the main Sensory Lab is Total Breeze. Let me show you how to truly cutting edge tech. We developed this fax travel system to help folks zip between many office locations. Let me zap from this satellite office to the main sensor lab in an instant. Give it a try. What do you say, Mario? Want to fax travel to the main sensor lab? Such advanced technology. There's no way anyone could possibly beat this. My work here is incomplete. Paragon the end unfinished, so back to it. Wait, you didn't have anything for me? Okay. At the very least, all of the different toads will be different colors, right? I'm back. You didn't have anything for me, though. Alright, I'm leaving. I definitely prefer pipes. It's somehow less gross. Are we sure this is even the real Mario? Now that he's been faxed? Yeah, but wasn't... No, I guess he wasn't. He was on top of it. Because he wasn't the main... guy stuck on the fax machine, but I think he was on top of the... mushroom part, so I guess that would have still worked? Gee, I wonder what I have to do here. Uh, I couldn't think of anything. Hmm. Uh, as long as you don't replace his hat, I think it's still Mario. Oh, and his mustache. He needs his hat and his mustache. As long as he has those, he's still Mario, according to every game. Money. Yeah, but Luigi has a green hat, and his mustache isn't as good, apparently. Also, we got a new partner in our party, and he's just gone. I 
I don't exactly know what you're referring to, but yes, that Mario is not actually Mario. As soon as he loses his hat, um, then his shiny boots break. Well, dang, I can't kill Paragoompas anymore. That's kind of annoying. Let's see, do I have any? Nope. Darn it. Where's my super hammer? That's a lot of guys. That's a lot of Goompas. It. I guess I have to use iron boots because I don't or I have fire flowers boom boom hello Reeslane welcome to Mario's yeah, I don't like the item system being destructible stuff, especially since I... There's no real way, even if I solve the puzzles, there's no real way to make it so I just kill them. Because I don't level up, so like my normal boots are still... Well, that was my bad. I didn't press it fast enough. You know, my normal boots are always going to be the same strength. And that's no fun. Perfect lineup. But whatever. There are there are alternatives. Like, you know, setting them on fire. And that's always a good alternative. I wonder if there's a toad nearby. Nah. Phew, that rock almost took me out, but there's no way I'd let it beat me. What am I, scissors? No, I'm paper! Wow, this is a beautiful spot. Amazing what you miss when you're stuck behind a sticker. <laughs> Gotta get all this money. Well, there are alternatives for that too, like bug fables. Phew, finally! I've been waiting to say this for ages, so listen up! Turn battery-powered items off, on and off by pressing Y. Isn't that incredible? Gotta tell everyone. Yeah, exactly. Like bug fables. Now the little dragonfly told me that you've been using the 1000 folded arms technique. That's so cool. Are they hard to control though? If you don't like motion controls, you can turn them off under the menu. I don't really care. Motion controls haven't been too atrocious this time. This time. Hmm. Am I really gonna use a thousand... Yep. <laughs> gonna use my ultimate technique just to smash a toad. Hey Mario, sorry I kept running away. I panicked. At least I learned that I'm pretty good at climbing walls. Eh, thought I had more stamina than this, but hey, at least it's raining. Is the rainwater also made of paper? Does that mean, like, when it rains paper, it's just... ...refilling the paper that evaporated from the paper fire? No. 
Also, I have to go all the way back because that stupid pipe is up there. So water is just water in this world. Even though it's also made of paper, but isn't made of paper. Paper physics are weird. It's also kind of weird that every character has this, like, weird white outline around them. You're weird! I made to the Water of Elemental Shrine! Hooray! Now we can finally meet the Water of Elemental! Definitely looks like the shrine's front door, but how do we open it? Hmm... Hmm? Oh, I think I got it, Mario. I bet you press both switches at the same time. That has to be it, right? Wow, I'm cute and clever. <laughs> Wait, no, I'm floating, so I can't press down the switch. Bobby, you have feet. Come put those things to good use. That's what I would tell him if he were here. Didn't he run ahead of us? So he should be here already, shouldn't he? You don't think he's still lost in the tall grass, do you? Oh, Bobby. I can't get to the shrine without that adorable little feet. Let's go find him. I don't think Olivia knows how floating works. Oh, thank you. You're outside the Water of Elemental Shrine? People say the shrine's home to massive terrifying water spirit, but people say a lot of things. Sure is an impressive building, isn't it? You think the Water of Elemental is the original shrine owner or has someone renovation stuff? Couldn't we just ask this toad to stand on the thing for us? We don't really need Bobby. Confetti bag! Why is that here? Yeah, I'm gonna complain about everything. I'm gonna complain about you not complaining about things that I'm complaining about. Just take that. <laughs> Alright, let's go save Bobby. No, toads aren't allowed to do anything. I think I could have lined these guys up too, but I'd have to use my boots. I don't want to use my boots. Besides, Hammer gets the job done. Hammer a day keeps the Goompas at bay. Alright, Bobby, where are you? How do I get this? How could they weigh a button down of their paper? It's a paper button! <laughs> yeah, they're paperweight. Maybe that's going to be a boss. Just an actual paperweight. I actually don't even remember where my paperweight went. I had like this really pretty... Uh, what do you call it? I don't know. I had like a wind kind of feel to it. It wasn't really silver, but... It was real heavy and real pretty. I don't know where it went. Probably weighing paper down somewhere. ...that I haven't touched in years. Where'd all those things come from?
Well, that didn't do a dang thing. Uh, I guess there might be a toad up there now? There wasn't one before. Where's Bobby? Bobby! We need your help! No, no, it's probably one up there, I guess. Maybe he went to the... Chestnut Valley? I think I'm being chased. Not sure, though. Oh, there he is. You wait for your best buds, huh? Same here. Having my buddies is pretty cool so far. I definitely recommend it. Bobby, what are you doing? Don't tell me you got lost in that tall grass. Big M, ma'am! Knew you'd find me sooner or later. Reunite with your buds is pretty cool too. I definitely recommend it. No, oh, you met up with your amigos. That's the best. Let's have ourselves a super duper canned food party day to celebrate Shy Oh My. A canned food party? That does sound like fun. Wait, no, no, no. We have to go see the water, water elemental. Come on, Bobby. Say goodbye to your uh, new friend. You got it, man. Let's mosey. A super duper canned food part day. Can't wait for my amigos to show up, shy old boy. He's gonna be alone. Hey look, he made it this time. How convenient that he got lost. Oh dang it. Oh, another new buddy! Doesn't look like the faulty guys. I mean he's friendly, right? Hey there, Stompy. I'm ba -bomb. What's your name? Well, didn't even have time to read that. Bobby, no! I should have warned him about the paper macho enemies. You'll pay for killing my new friend! He's definitely dead since he fell off a mountain. Although I guess they're all made of paper so they can just float down, but... Well, now what? So much for s going to see the water of Elemental, I guess we're gonna... Hmm. I don't know. Where does that go? I fell out the bridge. Are we gonna have to jump down after him? Oh gosh. Okay. Can never tell where there's an invisible wall, so... I'm stuck at the landing. Bold move, Mario. Jumping off a bridge to save poor Bobby. If we survived that fall, I'm sure he did too. We're bound to bump into his little guy if we just follow the path up and out of here, right? Maybe? Probably? Unless he fell into one of the bottomless pits and died. Or, you know, exploded, because he's a bomb. Wow, sturdy crates. What a... What a treasure. Put that one on the shelf. Whoa, what the heck is that? Something rolling this way. Oh, that has to be Bobby. I think we find him this fast. Bobby, please don't be a giant boulder. Not Bobby, not Bobby, not Bobby, not Bobby. It's not Bobby. It's a bunch of spiked balls. What part of this look like Bobby? Ow! Whoa, whoa, whoa.
Nah. I don't want to die. Oh, there's Bobby. Ouchie! Dang it. Hmm. I found out what I was supposed to do. Stupid cracked walls. Yeah. Stop that. I wonder if I'm supposed to have more health than this. Hmm? Boop. It's Toad, apparently. Three Toads. We're the Chestnut Trio! Thanks for conking our... something. Craniums? Hang on one second, Bobby. I got a sign! There's a sign that someone needs help here! Bing M! Bam! Thank you, saved me! I didn't mean to fall off that bridge, honest. I said I wouldn't slow you two down. I'm sorry. <laughs> my, my two best buds just saved my life. What a great memory this is gonna be. Uh, we're just glad you're okay. You have to be more careful, Bobby. Don't go tumbling over any more bridges, alright? That wasn't even his fault. <laughs> just ba bob ma'am. And I won't. I promise. I'd even pinky swear if I had a pinky. How do I know what a pinky is? Can we hurry out of here now? These pointy chestnut things look like they hurt. Okay, well, I'm glad you can bend reality to your whim whenever you feel like it. Yeah. And apparently you can ignore being crushed by a chestnut, but... Ow! Escape! Hmm... <laughs> These Goompas aren't right. <laughs> This is a neat callback to the classic Goompa enemies. I guess these aren't the classic ones. The originals are classic, but nostalgia ahoy either way. Hmm. I got nothing. Like, that doesn't solve anything. <sighs> Puzzles are difficult. Yeah, okay, I got three moves. I mean, obviously this is why they give you a timer so you don't just spend like 20 minutes working on one simple fight but I got nothing I mean I guess I could
No, nope, I'm not coming up with any solutions. I'm really bad at video games, guys. I don't know if you knew that about me. You could probably suspect it. But you never really realized it until now. If only I had Sivia's brain. You know, the brain that's good at puzzles. Uh... I don't know. I'll just take the hit. That did not do a lot of damage. Oh no, they're knocked over. I guess it did enough damage to kill them. What does jumping on them normally do? Nothing, okay. It just stunned them, I guess. So I should have jumped on the other ones. Wait, what? You do stuff? Since when was that a thing? Bobby did things, guys. Now he's asleep. Well, I'm sorry for failing the puzzle. It's embarrassing. What's in the box? Spinning shells. I don't think we've seen those before, but... Okay. I didn't know Bobby did things. I'm kind of glad he doesn't blow up, though. But it really just makes me miss Thousand Year Doors, Bomb. I'll let you know when I remember his name. I think it was just Bobbert. Oh no, Bobby! <laughs> Again! Oh no! The walnuts were walnuts and their chestnuts in, in disguise. Well, he's gone. I think we've lost him more than we've lost any other partner. Oh, that ah, oh, I didn't make it go down far enough. Whoops, that's my bad. These mutated Goompas are gonna get me. Attack power now! Did they ever explain why the Goompas looked weird in that game? Like, now they're just a thing, but... Why did they look weird? Can't believe this! Big M, I mean Mario. Wait, now he's got me doing it. 
can't just make it more than a few feet before Bobby vanishes again. Can't tell where the trouble is always finding him or he's seeking it out. Probably both. Yeah, is this gonna be the theme? Just Bobby keeps getting destroyed. Huh, okay. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> A fire flower! Oh no, he was too fast for us! Quick, beat him up! Alright, line them up. Don't mess it up this time. There, easy peasy. You know, this isn't gonna be the theme of the game where you keep losing your partner as soon as he shows up. Look at all those toads. I remember back in the day when there were more than just toads cheering me on. Those were the days. Oh, I had to pull it out. All the others just popped out. Thanks so much, Mario. These chestnuts sure are a pain. Taking too many hits from your own chestnut. Just press Y and take the mushroom break. Own chestnut? I don't... I don't own a chestnut. I think. How did you get up there? You went down. I saw you fall down. Also, how do I get over there? I don't think I can, so... I don't think I can screen wrap. I don't think he should be able to screen wrap. But hey, a thousand coins is a thousand coins. Can I jump down here? No? Okay. Alright, back down we go then. Alright, how do I get up there? There's a pipe, okay. Where's the pipe? Down here? No. Oh, there's a pipe, okay. Also, who said these guys could respawn? I didn't sign up on the respawn wrappers. Also, this is the same puzzle. Weird. How do you guys feel about this game so far? It's enjoyable. For me. It's not like the best, but it has enjoyable parts. Hey, I'm here. 
Moon is dead. Why? <sighs> there he goes again. I take back what I said. This isn't enjoyable. I'm sorry, Bobby. That's the only way I know how to rescue people. Yeah, it's definitely better than Sticker Star by a landslide. Bobby's not up here. He could have tumbled back this far, right? I don't know at this point. Thank you so much! Gucci! I never played Collar Splash, but I will accept that it's better than Collar Splash. I'm not sure Paper Jam actually qualified as a Paper Mario game. I think the only good part of that game was Paper Bowser. Like, from the paper part of it, at least. And that was just because it was funny watching Bowser talk to himself, more or less. Nothing else interesting really happens, so I guess it's probably better than Paper Jam too. I still don't get why they're not allowed to be more unique. Like I wish I could talk to Miyamoto and be like, "Hey, what? What's with this? What's the deal?" I mean, it's not like you can get in trouble for making things more unique, right? Unless Nintendo's copyright striking themselves. Oh no, they might actually be copyright striking themselves. That does sound like a thing they might get into. Dang it. How did he get up? That isn't... But he tumbled... How did he get in front of us? That's not how screen wrapping works! I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. Like, I'd line them up. What do you want? Chestnuts, please. It's a toad, kill it! Ah, we search high and low for the fearing the worst, but he's been sleeping right by the exit. Let's show him how relieved we are by getting him with the oh so gentle wake up tap, Mario. Ah! Uh, I beg him, found a shortcut after I tumbled downhill. Neat, huh? Took you two or a minute to catch up, so I guess I dozed off. Thank goodness, glad we don't have to go searching for you anymore, right? Now let's finally go visit the Water Elemental Shrine. Sounds good to me. Water Elemental, here we come. But first, let me whack a toad. I must flutter. Hey, we got all the toads. All right, back up the Autumn Mountain. Avoid these guys that I can't kill in one shot anymore. I guess I could go shopping, but I don't want to. Let's work. Oh, 
Watch him be insulted. Okay, Bobby, hop on that switch. Gotcha, no sweat. Wait, is that all you guys need me here for? Was just to step on a switch? You're not gonna tell me to leave as soon as you've I press on the switch, right? Well, I'm just gonna leave before pressing the switch. Yes, we did it. Now we can go to the shrine. Aren't you coming to the shrine with us? No, oh, me, I'm uh, pretty wiped out after pressing that switch. Yeah, that's it. Definitely not scared to wander into a dark, dark, dank shrine full of traps and monsters. Nope. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna sit this one out, but, uh, say hi to the water elemental for me. Sounds like a wet and adorable, I'm just gonna say it. You know, if the light goes out, I'll probably die or lose my memory. Don't know. Feel like I've been sizzling this whole time, right? Now, are they gonna throw us for a loop and the water elemental is not gonna be a dragon, but instead be a frog? Check out that stone dragon in the back. Is that the water elemental? Bobby's really missing out. There's a toad here. I can smell him. Where could he be? Use your precious confetti supply to save little old me? Shucks! By the way, throwing confetti that lands outside the knot bottom's hole won't vanish, so don't worry about wasting it. Uh, I don't know if that's accurate, but alright. Thanks. What's in door number left? Oh, it was an enemy. This might be the first crab enemy I've ever seen. Alright, I have the sinking feeling that these guys are, uh, not safe to jump on. Might be the pointy claws that they're raising towards the roof. But I feel like smacking them with a hammer is probably better. Iron boots! Shiny iron boots. Alright, cool. I'll save those for when I need them. Wasn't there a Mario game where they actually did have a crab enemy? Might have been Mario World. Probably where these are from. No. What do I do? How do I line up these kids? Uh-oh. I messed up. Oh well. What's one turtle gonna do to me? Alright, the other turtles might still be alive, but... At least these crabs will be dead. Now! There. They're all dead. And nothing of value was used. Especially not a shiny hammer. All right, come here, crab. Not sure I actually hit him. I did. Um. I did it.
<sighs> There's like three ways you can mess up each fight. And either way is a pain. What? A blue crab? Where'd you come from? Well, time for shiny iron boots. Because I don't think I can deal with lining them up for the hammer. Oh, I didn't equip it. Oh, I didn't equip it. It's extra bothersome that I have to equip the stupid disposable weapons. But oh well. Uh oh. They're still alive. They're too powerful. Ow! Um... Hmm... There we go. I don't like shiny crabs. They're able to withstand being hammered. Alright, let me equip my shiny iron boots. That's all I've got. Man, I got a new person in our party and he just ditches us like 20 times. I don't even care that he has a name now. He's the worst. Oh, great. Sliding block puzzles. My favorite. What in the world is this thing? You probably had to put that thing there and do something somewhere else. No idea where to start. I mean, that's... that's the answer. It's just the... there isn't a block there. Dang it! Crabs. Now you feel like a nail, Mr. Crabs. I don't want to line them up. I don't know how. Okay, well that does confirm at least that they will stab you. Oh, right. I do remember that. You could also... I think in Mario World, if you played two-player mode, you could fight your... friend for... their in-game card, or end of the level cards, so you can steal their extra lives. Hmm. I get ditched all the time. I basically live in a ditch. Hmm. Oh, was it Mario 3? Yeah, it was. I was... Thinking of the right game, but the wrong name. Mario World's when they got all... Fancy. I got no idea how to do this one. There we go. I went the wrong way, but I dealt with it. See, this game tricks you by making you want to put the correct enemies together, but you don't have to.
More crabs. Uh, but this one's gonna be a pain because I have to use iron boots. Thankfully, I haven't used the iron boots too much, so never mind. I was gonna say it'll probably be a bit before they break. Nope. <laughs> Already on their last legs, which will be mine. There he is. Look at that. Oh. Well, in that cute. And look, he turned blue. Stop it. Oh, and he's flipped. Cool. Um. Um... No, give me a second. Give me more than nine seconds, please. Um... I mean, I guess I just do that, sure. I probably should have flipped them around, but yeah, that works. Alright, let's see if this kills them. Nope, only the red ones. They're flipped over and can't move. Now finish them off. I got a groovy panel. I don't know if I'd call it groovy, but sure. Hmm, where was it that we saw this thing? It definitely wasn't in just, you know, the room over. That would be silly. Of course, it's the tile we picked up is a perfect fit for this thing. Why do I still have this? Hmm. Just the right size. See if we can't slip in the tile. One last step. Do I have to do this again? Okay. Oh no! Following my exact movements? That's not a good sign. Yeah, that water is definitely made of paper. We did it! Look at all the water! Where do you think it goes? Oh hey! Look at the things! Oh, I guess I'm allowed to walk in water? Okay. Can't swim, but I can walk in it, even though it'll get me soggy. Oh, but I can't go in here. Sad days. How convenient that it filled up right as we got in here. Huh? The dragon looks a little doofy. Hey look, a treasure chest. I'm sure that's not important. Uh oh. Oh. 
Now I can't leave. Water of Elemental's mouth is half open now. Looks kind of shocked. Must be amazed we solved that super hard tile puzzle. I mean, who's ever solved a sliding block puzzle like us? Why is this rotating now, though? That's obnoxious. Oh, whoops, I accidentally left. Oh, hey, you guys are back. You gotta just, uh, I guess you're still busy in there. All right, well, I'll sit here and wait. I was gonna try to jump down, but I guess it's not an option. Could I not have gone this way before? Hmm. I wasn't really paying attention to it. Hello crabs, hello bats. Dang it bats! I thought we were friends! Oh man, these guys are all over the place. Wouldn't be too complicated, but... Let's see... These guys are all over the place, and I don't know where they started. I mean, yes, they started right there, but that's not what I mean. Hmm. Nope, I got nothing. Sorry guys, I didn't know how to deal with these swoops. Now. That's okay. They'll be pretty healthy. Line them up! Even though you literally can't. Never mind, you did. I guess one on his own counts as a lineup. I did it. Confetti! I wonder if there's a toad nearby. There's something back there. Oh my gosh, Mario, thank goodness you noticed me. I thought I was doomed to live my life as a window as window dressing this damp forgotten shrine. And look, I'm max health, so my I think your HP just increased again, Mario. You seem a bit stronger to boot. Well, my joy of being rescued turned into an actual heart. I didn't know I could do that. Maybe I could make a sandwich appear next if I think about how hungry I am. No. Hearts only. Unless you want a heart sandwich. How do I get back there? There's a box back there. Dang it. Crabs and bats. Hmm... Only two moves.
There we go. Easy breezy. And it does look like I'm a point stronger. Hooray. All the bats are dead. Long live the bats. Wasn't there a box over here? Was, was I only down here for a toad and some confetti? Uh. There's a box right there too. I need all the treasures, guys. Why don't they understand this? Hmm. I wonder what could be the solution to this one. Ah, I got nothing. I've got all this money, but nothing to spend them on. Maybe I should use Toad Power more when I can't solve a puzzle. Or use the intended, you know, time saver, but... Restaurant fridge? Shouldn't that have been back in the other mountain? I guess they wouldn't want to spoil me. Hey look, another box. Wave battle! Now we get to fight two crabs! They never saw that coming. Till I get smacked with a hammer. Wait, how do I... Oh, I see. There we go. Last wave? I wish. This will be their last turn! Yes, transform! Into... A turtle! Finally, the good stuff. Wow. Even the toads don't like the normal puzzle game. And they're all dead. Hello, crab. Oh, are you unable to... Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to smash him. But the crabs can only go side to side. They live in an internal level of 2D, even though they're folded into 3D. What a terrible life. Wait, I didn't want to do that, actually. Oh well. Goodbye, Iron Boots. I didn't have a choice. I did it! And also, my Iron Boots exploded! Or not. I guess I still have them for one more turn. Aha! I got the PAL block! If only this was a real PAL block. Hmm, why isn't that an item? It probably is, but... Being able to flip things would be pretty nice.
Line them up. What are you gonna do, Mario? I'm gonna whack them with my hammer. You know, like normal. I just realized we haven't seen Bowser in forever. I thought he was like a more active character in this game. But nope. He flew off in the beginning, we haven't seen him since. And he can't be the water blue mantle because uh, he shoots fire most of the time. Guess I should have grabbed that before destroying those blocks, huh? Whoops. Maybe if I leave and come back, they'll be... Bowser's right behind me. Yep, here they are. I don't believe you. There's no way Bowser could be right behind me and not tell me that he's right behind me. It's impossible. Dang it. A perfect lineup! Alright, I have to use these shiny iron boots. Actually, the regular iron boots may have sufficed. Oh well. Look at this game giving me health, as if I took any damage here. Just mental damage. Aha! It is an item! Hooray! I knew if I complained it would come true. I just had to wait a minute. Shame there's no toad shop here either. Complaining so it shows up. Another water elemental statue with a lot of water coming out of its mouth. Not sure if it's making me thirsty or the opposite of thirsty, but it sure makes me feel something. Anyway, I guess being the water elemental means you just really like water. You'd have to, right? I mean, not necessarily. You could just hate water and just be affiliated with it. Hmm. I wonder if I need to put water there. Nah. What's over here? Could it be a toad? The most embarrassing part of being a window dressing is knowing that my collar clashed with the decor. I don't know, you were blue. That kind of... kind of fits. Welcome back. I complained and got something else handed to me, Mimikyu. The pal block became an item. Line them up. Uh, uh I hate sharp things too. But I hope your speech went well. Well, I guess if you were just recording it, then it's not over yet. I know it would drive someone crazy if I just left that coin sitting there. Oh, go up here. I don't think the other one let me do that, so... No! Oh, I'm fine! 
Oh no, now he's crying. That doesn't make me feel good. I whacked him on the head and he started crying. Oh boy, more puzzles, but first I have to go find the other puzzle. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make him cry. There it is. Hey, the pencils had it coming. You see the way they drew that toad? Super rude. He was a blue toad, dang it. Now I'm over here, I guess, but that's not where I want to be. You can't cancel me. I'm already... Oh, no. I'm already being attacked by crabs. What more can you do to me? Um... Oh, man. They're everywhere. What do I do? I did it! Ugh. Are you crabs? I'm hammering here. Give me that magic circle. Alright, I don't need to deal with these puzzle creatures. I'll just pop them. Go, Olivia! And there all the crabs are dead. Never stood a chance. I hope that toad... I hope there's like a character arc for these toads where they, they learn how to whistle. A groovier panel. A coffee shop? So? Your creations don't make you respectable. Well, well, look who's stopping in for a cup of joe! It's Mario! What can I get you? Whatever that was, I ordered it. Ah. Can't say I ever expect to see you stumble in here, Mario. Try to keep this place a secret. Minions come here to unwind after a long day of pacing back and forth. Probably not supposed to be serving you like this, but I'll make an exception. Long I got you, Mario. You great Goombas are the strongest minions, right? I mean, we're usually the first ones you have to face, you know? We're the front line. That's proof we're Lord Bowser's favorites. We always give 110%. <laughs> Pfft, keep dreaming, pal. I mean, keep dreaming, pal. Shy guys give 120% everywhere every day. We're the clear favorite. Which menu was piling the boss's clown car during that big rescue at Peach's Castle? A shy guy. I even heard the origami jerk who started this whole mess was disguised as a shy guy. Can it, you dorks. <laughs> Sorry, Mario. These two are always getting at it like this. Goombas and shy guys, Mario and minions. We're all pressed from the same pulp. Drink your coffee. Thank you. I know a shy guy who knows a shy guy who can wail on guitar. Goopas can't even hold one. Some Goopas even have wings. Ever seen a shy guy with wings? Didn't think so. Uh, I have. 
Come back anytime. Alright, well, see ya. Well, that was nice. Hmm. I found it! What's down here? Oh. Before I came in. Uh, in Pokemon, there's a Pokemon Cafe. Gosh, Mimikyu, don't you know about Pokemon Cafe? You're in it, I think. Probably. Alright, time for another sliding block puzzle. I saw a title in this opening, too. Alright, let's see. Oh, that one goes there. Okay. Like, I don't have anything that goes that way, but... I said there's Pokemon Cafe Mimikyu. Pretty sure you're in it, so you should know about it, right? And yeah, this puzzle. reset it. Can I reset it? Yes, there we go. Okay. Whoops. goes there. That goes there. That does not go there. Uh... Oh, okay. Uh, how do I do this? I mean, I guess I can just go... Yeah, I think I had it and then messed it up. Oh, whoops, I forgot to put that one back. Like, what did I miss here? Um... Do I have to use every single thing? If so, I have no idea. Uh, 
Uh, now I'm just moving things. I'm not even thinking. Okay. Can I go the opposite way? Can I go down? Yes. No. There's no block that goes straight up. I'm a dummy. When puzzle is puzzling, you puzzle with the best of them. Okay. didn't do it, but I thought I did it. Except I didn't. Uh... That's not what I meant to do, but... Well, that could work. I just gotta get that one down there. Without, you know, completely messing it up. Stupid sliding block puzzles. And now I gotta get this one right there. Whoops. There. It was an S the whole time. I'm glad it doesn't show every single movement I make. Cause boy, that would be annoying. It was an S for Snake. A pipe? Money! And a lot of stuff. I can't believe you did it! Water of Elemental's mouth is wide open now. Almost like it's roaring. Rawr. Look inside its mouth. Are those stairs? Must be the way of the Water of Elemental. Oh, we can make it up those stairs with the, without, you know, the statue chomping down on us. And eating our flesh. That would be a shame. But how do I get the treasure? The game didn't tell me. I mean, maybe now that it's full of water, I can do something? Bite of 87, what? Dang it, how do I get in there? There's a box right there. There's a... Hmm... Confetti? Confetti did not work. Yeah, I guess that's the answer. I just don't. Just don't. 
Don't even think about doing it because don't. All right, move. Go say hi to the water elemental or whatever. No, the confetti doesn't disappear, so it's not a waste. Gee, I wonder what could be waiting for us here. It's not pollution, the world is made of confetti. I was restoring the planet. That is an adorable confetti dragon. It's the water elemental. Someone folded it up. It doesn't look like the stone face of the main room at all. Come on, Mario, let's try to bop it back into its former glory. Look at those water spouts! I expected the water elemental to control water, but not like this. Summon spouts! Use the arrows. Yeah, of course. It's not gonna work. Uh, hello, cool. Hope you're having a good day. Oh wait, it'll go that way. So, It washed the panels away. Come on, Water Elemental, stop waking waves. Takes flight, bring it down with a jump, then follow it up with your hammer. Okay. Thanks, random note. I'll make note of that. Mario's turn! Oh no! You missed? Oh no, that means the 1,000 followed arms can't reach the water elemental in the air. I mean, it could have if I just, you know, grabbed it first. Instead of trying to smack it. Uh-oh. Ow. Alright, so I have to jump on it first. I wasn't actually paying attention to what it did with the spout. Does the water elemental look a little waterlogged to you? It soaked that water up like a sponge, a super strong, super deadly dragon sponge. Use the arrows. I wanna. Uh-oh. I moved too many times. Yeah, I gotta move, but then I didn't do anything with it. Remember to end your uh, route on action panel, or you won't be able to do anything, you dummy. Now. It got really fat. I don't know what to say about that. Let's see... 
Now let's go the easy route on this one. Oh, super jumps. You're acting like I was paying attention to what the toads were saying. Ow. Now I will. Thanks, Mimikyu. Oh, the elemental belly looks like it's fit to burst. It's getting ready for something big. Mario, brace yourself. Uh, what do I do here? I have to get that too. Oh, that's gonna wash it away, though. Hmm. Hmm, that one goes backwards. That's not good. To a safe high place? How would I do that? Oh, the turtle maybe? Let's see... Okay, that place is safe. Well, it being on right there isn't gonna... I can't do anything with that. Well. There goes all that. Yep, that arrow was in my way. Well, that was a little painful. But now it's all tuckered out. That wave was huge! That was a one-off. We need to find a way to defend ourselves before that happens again. That attack really wore the wire of elemental out. Now it's our chance. I probably won't. So don't worry about that. Alright, let's see if this does damage or just guards us. Earth Elemental! Okay, that does just guard us. Worthless! <laughs> but now I know. Oh, wait. You gonna slam down? Yeah! Damage. It's too drained to attack. Your defense was worthless. But I needed to heal, so I had to take it. Alright, here we go.
Okay. Uh oh. May have messed that one up. Okay, I can take it back. Cool. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Um... you're on the ground, so I hit you with my hammer! Kaboom! Ow. Alright, that went pretty well. Let's see if we can do it again. Probably not. Okay, that'll go there, and then that'll go there. So if I can put this here... And then this here... Yeah, that looks right, I think. A shiny hammer! But I messed up! Ow. Alright, he's getting bigger. Okay, this one will be washed away, so I have to get something else. Do this. Okay, that'll work. And then we go... Nope, that'll just send me in a circle. Doesn't do anything. Hopefully this works. It probably will. Yep, we go that way. We get an extra move. Cool. Big time. I don't think it'll hold back if you don't find shelter. This might be really bad. Guard, you fool. Um. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait. Um... Okay, take that back.
Okay. I think that works. Ugh, puzzles. Alright, hopefully being on a giant rock will protect me from this wave. Even though it's at point-blank range. Fly, you fool! That doesn't do anything, but... Being up here will hopefully keep me safe. Hooray! It did! Guard! Guard, you fool! I did it! Alright, time to throw hands. 1,000 of them. Why does this thing keep popping up here? Well, it's like it's gotta be here. Health up. Such raw, wiggly power! Well, sorry Mimikyu. I beat it before you got back. I did it! No. And I got a book. That was an adorable dragon, though. I want an origami dragon like that. Turn to another Biblifloe, just like the last one. You got it! Alright. Time to become a dragon queen. Let's see. Oh, I get it. Now you just start by folding it here, like this. You fold this part along here, then you do this, then that. I've got it! Hello, Phoenix. I'm sorry. I didn't really think it would kill him with a thousand hands. I think I got it. I've mastered the folds of the water elemental. Let's get this new power a try, shall we? Elemental power! The Dragon Queen is born! How do I look? Am I dignified and like a water elemental? Ugh, I actually feel extremely well hydrated. I'm overflowing! Stand back! I'm to fill up this cave, which was already full of water though. Hmm. I don't know how that one works. Oh wait, no, it did drain when we started the fight. They turned it into water tornadoes. Did you see that? Did you see me? I hope that looked as cool as it felt. Now we can fill that dried lake back up for sure. No, she actually becomes massive somehow. A tiny one would be adorable though. I was going to ignore that we, you know, killed the water elemental, but, you know, we killed the earth one, too. Alright, I have to be able to get that box. There's no way I can't, right? How do I get that box? There's a box here, but I got that one.
But I want that box! How do I get the box? Bobby, you really did wait! You missed one heck of a show. The water elemental was so cool, and we got a new power. Uh, really? It was actually cool? Like, really? Huh, so I guess I missed an option up some water monster. That's fine, that's cool. Maybe I'll meet it some other time. Don't worry, you'll see its power in action soon enough. Head to the lake and try the water elemental ability. Nah, I want that box. Why? Why would you make this? Swoops, leave me alone. Swoops, leave me alone. How do I get this box? Mario, do the thing. You didn't do the thing. Aha! I did it. I got a max up heart treasure. So not really a max up part, but the treasure of a max up part. Mm. Alright, cool. We did it. I got the box. All that mattered. Dang it. Oh, these guys are everywhere again. I don't remember the solution to this puzzle. Actually, I don't think I'd found the solution to this puzzle. I think I just said whatever. Alright, we got three moves. Let's see. I got nothing. I'm not good at these. Go, my toad army! Kill them all! The toads figured it out for me. I wasn't paying attention, so I don't know what the solution was. But no harm, no foul, and I use my money for something. I'm almost 30,000 coins, so... I did it! Sort of. Alright, let's get out of here. I think I pretty much got everything here, right? I think I'm missing a- yeah, I'm missing a question block, but... The question is, who cares? Also, Phoenix, uh, this is Bobby. Bobby the bob -omb. I complained that he didn't have an actual name, so Olivia gave him a name. Which was the same name I gave him. 
you know, typical me fashion. Uh, but that said, I think that actually should be a good stopping point for right now, because I should probably eat something today. And I have to go fix my PS4, which will be annoying. In case you're like, what the heck are you talking about? My PS4 updated and then broke. So... I have to figure out how to fix that nonsense. So wish me luck. But, thanks so much. Yeah, rip Bombas. That was his first, her first name, and then she chose Bobby. Yeah, just the classic, oh, PS4 needs to update, and then suddenly it stopped working. That's why we're playing this today instead of Zero. That was the plan. But anywho, I will see you all later. Thanks so much for watching our Paper Mario adventure, and look forward for it to continue. My complaints aside, I'm having fun, even if it's mostly puzzles. Well, you know. Anywho, bye for now. Thanks for watching.